I don't care what you say. Ain't nothing like waking up to your own. May not have everything I want, but I dang sure got everything I need and more. Thank you, God. Hey babes, welcome back to another vlog. This portion of the video is sponsored by Shein. They did send over to me this really nice bob unit. I did get some free wig caps in the box, which we greatly appreciate. Guys, this is a glueless HD lace frontal bob. It is a 6x4 closure. It also is 12 inches i believe it is 180 percent density i did go in and add that tinting spray just to make the knots you know more seamless and also to make it match my complexion it does have an adjustable strap and it is on a dome cap it is a nice construction it fits super snug and what i love guys it comes pre-cut that's the most amazing part. Like you don't have to do any work. And once I put the wig on my head, it felt so secure. Like look at that, like it is snug. I could shake my head, move it around and it wouldn't move. And then I'm going in with my Ebon spray. I could have worn it glueless, but I wanted it to be more seamless. So I did do that. And then I'm applying this unit. This is an affordable unit, very cost effective, and it's great quality. It is a nice grab and go unit. You could always bleach the knots, which will give you a way like more seamless look. But baby, you know your girl don't do all that. Like we ain't got a time for that. So I'm going in with my hot comb just to get it straightened. And then I did add some foundation on the part, I believe, just to make the part more there. And then I am going to go in and flat iron the hair. This is a bob like straight to the point. If you like this length, you can keep it like this, which I did. And you could also go in and like cut it if you would like. It is pretty full from the root to the tip. So it's not see-through or anything like that. So I appreciated that. So I did not cut it or did, did like anything crazy i just went with how it came and i'm loving it and this is what we look like after you know we had a little bit of makeup and i'm just going in with a light oil and then i will straighten the hair and that's pretty much it like the hair is so straight to the point and guys after this video i wore this wig a couple of times and i did not um i did not glue it down i literally just picked it up put it on and I was able to go outside. I've worn this wig to the gym. It has held up really, really good. And every time I wear it to the gym, I don't glue it down and it stays in place right through my workout. So I'm really enjoying this wig. It's a great affordable bob and I definitely think you guys should get your hands on it. This is my first Shein wig I've ever tried and I'm actually very surprised, well I can't talk, I am pleasantly surprised. It's nice quality and it's very affordable. This is the finished look. Let me know if you like it down below. Huge shout outs to Shein for sponsoring this portion of the video. Let's get into the video vlog
Hey babes, so we're doing a bit of cleaning today, a deep clean, and it's not going to be like a complete reset vlog. It's more so about deep cleaning my space. I have a few things coming up where I won't be able to give my house this kind of deep clean and love so i decided to do it and get it out the way and also i wanted to reset my home and take down my fall stuff i know i kind of recently did the fall stuff i don't know how long i've had the fall stuff up but i want to take it down because for the month of november i will not be able to lift anything heavy or move anything heavy so i decided to do it it is the end of the month you see me starting out there with cleaning the bathroom i cleaned under the sink that took me a moment and then now i'm just like getting my bedding washed all nice and clean i just want you guys to watch this vlog and enjoy it i will pop in here and there to like you know let you guys know what's up but i just want this to motivate you to clean your space or reset everything because cleanliness is next to godliness and honestly when i have a cleaner space i can think straight i can function like i feel like my whole life is just better once my space is clean so just like like this video comment down below make sure you're subscribed and then just keep on watching
and guys i am dusting everything like there was so much dust in my room so i'm dusting the picture frames um the artwork i should say over my bed the mirrors and just everything and y'all my bed was giving me a hard time because usually you lay down it molds to your body while stepping in it it's just like squishy and it's just like a lot going on out here i am trying to clean the fan and i'm just like yo this is trying to take my life because the bed keeps just like squishing in so that was an experience anyways i am cleaning the mirrors and i did clean the headboard that i have well the bed frame because it is a fabric um bed so i did clean that with the vacuum cleaner and I dust the entire thing, even like the base of it, I dust that. I also had moved away the nightstands and I dust and vacuumed behind the nightstands. I dust the lamps and I also had moved the curtains away, like the drapes that are at the windows. I moved those away and I dust the um, the blinds, the windowsill. I didn't record that, but I was doing that. I was doing a whole bunch, y'all. And then this is where I'm putting on my duvet cover and it took me a hot second. Like I was getting tired, guys. I don't know why I decided to start this reset like after three in the afternoon i honestly should have started in the morning like i went to the gym i was doing some work stuff and then at like three something i'm like yo you need to clean the house you need to get it together and i decided to do it so this reset well this deep clean it's not a reset i don't even know what it is but like this whole cleaning thing was not planned out properly and i started just like mid afternoon because i wanted to get it done for so long and i kept putting it off so i started in the afternoon child and we did not get finished until super duper late and you're gonna see i didn't get to do everything that i wanted to do but the main areas that i wanted to work on i definitely got a chance to do that i cleaned my room so good like it was a deep clean i vacuumed i even went under the bed but i didn't show all that guys but i did that I vacuumed everything but just like keep on watching oh and wow it's me almost taking my own life while trying to get around the bed you didn't see that but keep on watching <laughs> Also, because I didn't want to steam my sheets, I took them out of the dryer and I laid them out on the chair, as y'all saw in like the previous clip. And when I do that, it allows the sheets to stay like, you know, nice and crisp versus being crumbled. And then what I did when I made the bed, I pulled the sheet really like taut really tight i pulled it really good and that helped so it didn't look like crinkled it actually turned out pretty good because i just was not in a steaming mood
Hey guys, just a quick... I sound so stuffy. There was so much dust in my room, but now it's really, really clean. But guys, it's 6.30. I started like getting into the cleaning at like 3.30 something. But then maintenance came. They had to fix something under the sink. So that kind of like took a while for them to do. And then they changed the filter for me in the AC. So right now my bedroom is so clean. I'm so excited. I can't wait to go to sleep tonight. Honestly, having a clean space, clean sheets, clean bed, vacuumed, everything is clean when you take that shower it hits different when you go in that bed the sleep hits different i'm just so excited anyways um i'm gonna pause because it's 6 30 i'm gonna go take paxton for a walk he needs to potty and he also needs to eat i need to eat but i don't know um i didn't want to do this video tonight but it has to continue um i have to clean the stove, the microwave, the refrigerator. No, the refrigerator is clean. We did that. We did that. We did that. I forgot. Um, I'm still doing laundry. I want to do the living area. I want to vacuum. I want to mop. And I want to switch the cushions out. I also want to take these things down. These are the things from uh, my fall decor. I want to remove them. I don't know what we're going to put there, but I'm taking everything down. And yeah, I don't know what time I'm going to get finished tonight, but I'm doing everything. I'm not gonna lie, I am so tired. It's about 6.58, back in the house. I did take some salmon out to cook, but I didn't season it or nothing. I don't know how that's gonna taste, just throwing it in the thing. I'm so hungry. Um, I'm trying to see what I can eat. I do have like a packet with like ribs that's already cooked. I might just put that in the oven. So while that is like, you know, cooking itself, it's already cooked, I mean, I can just like, do the living room let's go because what can i do it's seven o'clock basically i'm gonna feed paxton and then we're gonna get to this cleaning because i'm not carrying this into tomorrow i stay up anyways on my phone all the time doing rubbish so we're gonna clean this is what it is yeah Guys, right about here, as soon as I started to vacuum, uh, the battery died. <laughs> I'm just like, bro, you could have died any other time. But anyways, um, I had a extra battery charged up. And guys, while I was playing the living room, I decided to start a Netflix series. Like, 
I was getting super tired and I needed something to, I guess, watch or just like kind of hear in the background. So that's what I was doing. I was watching this, I guess it's a Korean drama. I don't know, but it was just keeping me company. And then I decided I was going to move the sofa away. And then at that moment, I'm like, oh, no, girl, we're not doing that. It's so heavy. I did not realize these, um, the pieces of the sofa was so heavy. I mean, I didn't take it to my house myself. The delivery people did. But girl, I tried to move it because I'm like, oh, let me move all the, the furniture and like vacuum. No, I quickly realized and I pushed it right back. So we only moved one of the sofa, one piece of the sofa. And now I'm just removing the cushions from the cushion covers from my cushions and then i'm putting back my other cushion covers which you will see guys i don't know why i just felt like i wanted the fall stuff gone and i wouldn't be able to do it in november so i'm like let me do it now it's the end of the month so yeah that's that's all because my friend asked me you took all your fall stuff down why and i'm just like listen it needed to go um and i wouldn't be able to do it further on so i decided to do it now i wanted my space to just feel clean again and just look just like just nice and clean and peaceful like i don't know the fall stuff was just getting to me i like a very clean space um i don't like clutter i don't like seeing a lot of stuff it stresses me out y'all i don't know how to explain it so here we are and i'm just vacuuming the sofa and just trying my best to like fluff her up and bring her you know make her look nice guys guess what after making the rings i looked on the packaging because i'm like it looks weird on the packaging it said to use by october 9th baby what date is today like october 25th so we gotta throw it in the garbage yeah guys i am extremely exhausted it's after 10. everything is done uh, for the most part the only thing is i need to finish doing laundry which i'll do tomorrow and also i have to 
just like tidy up a little bit the guest bathroom no one uses it so it's just like a light touch up just to you know make sure it's clean oh my god forgot to clean this mirror so i'm gonna do that then i'm gonna take a shower but i took most well wall of wall decor like down all the stems are gone everything i took the things off that table and i just wanted like that clean vibe that i usually have in my space um yeah that's pretty much what it's looking like i did put like the pumpkin over there with the candle just to keep it for now because right now my brain is not functioning well i don't know what else to do but i did reset my sofa to exactly what we had before which i love i like the clean open feel that i usually get when i step into my apartment so i just felt like i wanted that bag i didn't want the fall stuff anymore and if we were decorating for christmas now would be the perfect time to put the christmas stems in a christmas tree you know what i'm wondering if i should go to my storage and get my christmas greenery and just put it in in the vase right there we're not decorating for christmas i'm not doing like a christmas look or anything but that um kind of stems could definitely pop right there give us some greenery still have a light clean airy feel so i might do that i don't know or i might just get some fresh flowers put it there and be done with let's see how that goes but um i'm so happy <laughs> my apartment looks like my apartment the only thing is that I'm not used to having that vase right there. And I took everything off the table. So this is what we're working with right now. And I'm definitely going to shower. I don't know if I'm gonna end this vlog here. I think I will. I hope you guys enjoyed this clean with me. I'm extremely exhausted, bro. My sister was clowning me. She's like, you clean like you have a mansion. Why does it take you so long? It's because I'm deep cleaning. Y'all saw me clean under the sink. I had to throw stuff out, clean, and then I did my closet. I didn't show you guys that, but I threw some stuff, you know, out. And then I put some stuff that I wasn't wearing in something to put aside, like, to give away so that's what i was doing as well and then i deep cleaned my room which i haven't done in a while but yeah it feels way better in here i can't wait to finish up everything tomorrow i hope you guys enjoyed this vlog it's clean with me i hope you know it inspired you to clean your space like nothing beats a clean space don't forget to like comment and subscribe i look tired i look crazy i know i'm gonna take my shower the best shower ever because our bathroom is clean and then i'm going to sleep my eucalyptus is already in the diffuser i'm gonna sleep tonight baby yeah <laughs> bye guys